What's up guys, it's Mike Twain here and welcome to episode 8 of my Gothic 1 playthrough, the third, the third of the third run of the Gothic game, the first of this, the first of its series, The Path of Balear. This is episode 8, in this particular episode we're gonna go to the old camp, get ourselves the third rune, a magic circle, as well as the high rope of fire, and uh, Search for the focus stones, and uh, so without further ado, guys, let's begin. But before I'm gonna do all that, I'm first gonna deliver the message to the sect camp. Then I will go to the old camp, get myself some better equipment. Enhance my uh, runes. Ma well, keep saying runes, but it's actually magical circle from one to three, and uh, skip a day so that we can watch a event in the Gothic game. It's not really big of an event, you know, but it's funny to do so nevertheless because I tried in my three playthroughs. I tried two times to get it done. I was unable to do so because I didn't understand it fully even though it's fully in your face you know but uh you know there is this event once every week once every week there is an event and uh I, I always thought you know that at a certain point in the chapter a certain amount of days must have been passed you know so between that time you should be able to get that particular event, but that's not the case. The fall, if you skip through conversations a lot, don't sleep, etc., it's gonna take a bit longer than normally, you know. But on every, on the sixth day, the festival is being built, and on the seventh day, the festival will be active. Now, I'm not quite sure if you can participate that in the arena, I don't think you can. But at least it's fun to witness, you know, at least once. I always thought myself that it was removed out of the Steam version. But boy oh boy was I wrong. Which is good, which is good. I'm not listening to all them. There was a time when things were done before you get that Maybe. Hang on. I've been to the Orc Cemetery. There was nothing Maybe. there. No sleeper, no sign, no nothing. What about Baal Lucor and the Templars? They're all dead. Dead? But why? What happened? The entire cave system is teeming with Orcs. They killed all of the Templars. Baal Lucor and myself survived, but suddenly Baal Lucor went mad. He screamed that the sleeper had ordered him to kill me, and he intended to obey this order. It would appear he couldn't handle the fact that he hadn't found That's anything. Really not my problem. I don't believe that the influence of the sleeper can cause such Maybe. violent deeds. Like it cannot, issue, cannot, no. irrelevant. The most important thing is that Baal Lacour did not that, succeed in his madness. Iberion is our only hope now. How is Iberion doing? He won't wake of his own accord, and he is growing weaker and weaker. I know how to wake him up, but I need your help. What do you want me to do? Get me the healing herbs from the swamp. Five of the strongest kind should be sufficient. Please, hurry. Everything you hear. Already have them. Well done. Iberian woke up for a short time while you were out. Did he say anything? Yes. He said that you the sleeper is not Never what we think heard. he is. We must try not to awaken him again. All we can do is hope not that it is not, not too late to for Iberian. I... Iberian is dead. Our spiritual Maybe. leader has left us. It was Even your quick help could not prevent his death. What now, Kor Angar? I have always trusted have Iberian. Shortly me, before he died, he placed all his hopes on the escape plan of the Magicians of Water. Then we should support the Magicians of Water in their plan. They'll need the Focus and the Almanac. Both things are still in Kor Kalam's possession. 
Where is Quirk Alarm? In a rage, he set out with a couple of Templars to find his own way to the sleep. Damn, how can we get the focus now? I believe he left the book and focus in his laboratory. Here is the key for the chest. One moment! Yes? Take this rune of magic as a sign of our gratitude for your great deeds. This will allow you to teleport fast and easily to the courtyard of our temple whenever the need arises. Thank you. Hang on. That won't all right, so let's get myself my daily ration, sell some of my stuff in return for a couple of ore, and, uh, and go into the direction of the old camp and uh, enhance my magical circle to three out of four with the fire magicians. I've come to collect my daily ration. Here, take it! Three of the Northern Dark. But don't smoke them all at once. Maybe. You have to watch what you tell people. Let's talk about something else instead. Doubt that's ever likely to change. I'm sure you won't mind me if you're dis He's gone. Let's talk about something. All right, so let's deliver them. After witnessing the event, of course. That wasn't very clever. I'd like to trade with you. Good. Here. These are the weapons I have available I'm at the moment. To all the blathering anymore. Well, there must be something about that story after all. Some people never learn. That's really not my problem. It's obvious that there'd be trouble ahead. Wouldn't like to be in his shoes, though, <laughs> if you think. I'm not listening People to all the blathering talk. anymore. Well, hang on. Mm, that wasn't very go clever. rushing into anything. Well, there must be something about that story after all. I better keep out of it. I doubt that's ever likely to change. Let's make swords out of them. Let's see Let's if Balkadar has uh, any kind of a belly or rune magic. Well, there was a time when things were I already have healing, which is in Gothic 1 and Gothic 2 case it's neutral, but in Gothic 3 it isn't. So that all three paths have, you know, healing capabilities. Because in Gothic 3 you will have the skill capability regeneration, which is for the rebel and uh, the orc side you can only learn that from the orcs the orc leader Khan or the king Robar the second um, 
and in this case, you know, the only legitimate path for regional in Gothic 3's case, you know, is the path of Venus. But uh, I use healing at the moment as a neutral in Gothic 1 and Gothic 2, just so I can heal myself without the need of constant potions. I want to acquire. People don't need to know. There must be something about that story after all. That was I let me let me quickly double check. Fist of Wind is Adenos. Telekinesis is apparently Adenos. Sleep is also Adenos. Didn't know that before. Charm. Uh, I'm not quite sure. Can't remember a charm in uh, Gothic three unless they mean dominance. Then it's Enos. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna touch it. I will stick to the undead part. Alright, so let's finally go to the camp, to the old camp. We've got a, a festival to attend to. You very probably You have to watch what You shouldn't believe everything you hear. Because the only reason why I will not be able to learn healing in Gothic 3 with my other three paths is because of the fact that the only way to obtain it in Gothic 3 is to uh, do through the uh, statuette of Minos. You cannot get it through the statuette of Belial or the fire mages or training with the water mages etc. You can only get it by praying at an Enosh shrine and since that's only for Enos healing is out of reach for the second for Belial and Adenos unless it's a spell scrolls of course then it's allowed but spell scrolls of any kind is allowed in spite the god that they follow Let me quickly double check. Just making sure it was still the sixth day. Which it is, which is good. Since I have to go to the water mages anyways at the new at the new camp, I will be able to get myself uh, my first Balea rune, which is ball lightning. And then afterwards, about circle four, I can get chain lightning, and then circle five, I have nothing, and then circle six, I have breath of death and ring of death. And of course, the uh, spell scrolls from the Zardas to summon skeletons, demons, golems, and kill them with one swoop for all their free XP and reuse that XP to enhance his power. The only scrolls that he will keep is Army of Darkness. Right, the Fire Mage. That, that's ever likely to change. At least the bugger doesn't talk to me anymore, that's good. 
because I knocked him down. I was sick of his nonsense. Let's see if I can get the heavy armor. I doubt it, but first let me get the rune magic. Circle two and circle three. There was a time when things would have gone very different. Same old story. For the honor of magic. For the honor of Mahal. I am ready to enter the second circle. You have learned to understand the runes. Now is the time to deepen this understanding. When you join the second circle, you will learn the foundations of stronger battle spells, and above all, the secret of healing. But you need to learn much if you want to recognize the true secrets of magic. You know that you can use every rune as often as you like, until you've used up all of your own powers. But before you act, think about the point of your actions. You have obtained powers with which you may easily conjure up death and destruction. But a true magician only uses magic when it is necessary. Understand the situation. Then you'll recognize the power of the runes. You shouldn't believe everything. Could you teach me the third circle? The third circle of magic is one of the most important steps in the life of a magician. Once you've reached it, you'll cease to be a seeker. You have already come far on the path of magic. You have learned to use the runes. This knowledge is the foundation for your further path. Use the runes with deliberation. You may use a rune or not, but you must decide on one of these possibilities. Do not hesitate to use your powers as soon as you've made your choice. Understand your path, then you'll recognize the power of the decision. Basically meaning, you know, if you go for Enos magic, and you understand the correct moments on when to shoot a fireball, it can literally kill enemies relatively powerfully same with Adenos or same with Beliar if you use the powers of the runes in combination with your regular skills your face-to-face -face skills you know your rune capability are way stronger than they normally are when you're just shooting a fireball at them you know if you know how it works and understand the path that you walk upon Enos, Adenos, Beliar it will use give you more understanding in the power of your runes. Master, I'd like to wear the high robe of fire. The time has come. You are worthy of wearing the high robe of fire. Hang on. Whoop de doo. So I need two more levels, and then I have the fourth circle, which should be able to gettable and doable. But that remains to be seen. Um. Right, the bugger stone again. He ain't here. Where's the bugger? You have to watch the People always talk. Oh, you start work, eh? Well, Hello. I need better armor. You can have it when you're ready for it, and only if you have enough ore. I want a heavy guard's armor. Only the upper class of guards can have one of them, and I'm afraid it's going to be a long time before you make it that far. Meaning, I'll see you. The uh, fire mage's assassination. But you can get it. That's not a lie, but I will get it. It could mess up the whole playthrough, which means we'll at some point have to reload. You know, but that's fine. Um. All right. So that's done. Let's sleep till morning. Wait. What? So, so it's on the sixth day. Fuck. I thought that'd be cleared up story every time. not go rushing into anything. Uh, 
Uh, okay. So it's actually on the sixth day, not the seventh. Because uh, they, they, they have left. Aww. I'm not gonna do the whole shit just to get the uh, that little spot. I will do it later in my speed run. Hey, hey Diego. Hello. Hello. Take care. No, I didn't want to talk with Diego. I wanted to see the festival, but I missed it again, guys. Karma is a bitch. So the sixth day, not the seventh, but the sixth. Don't ask me why, because I'm confused at the moment. Because Gaddy says once a week, and a week has six, um, has seven days. <laughs> See, it's confusing me. All right, focus those to the mages, to the uh, Mizumadoshi. So when I saw them, they were done playing. Oh no, wait. You have to talk with the guy in front of it. Wait. Oh, that's pretty a lot to redo. Ah, oh, fuck it. For you guys. Especially for you guys. Let, let's see. Let's see if I can still do it. to rejoin the fire mage now etc you know what well, that's fine I totally forgot that you have to talk with um, one of the guys to activate it but it's on the sixth day not the seventh Listen, it's all a blathering anymore. We there must be something about that. All right, story. so let's check if I can activate it. Snaff, I need my food. Hello. You told me I could have as much stew as I wanted. And that's... Thanks. You gotta have something to eat. Oh. And now they're gone. Probably because it's night time. Karma again. Karma is a bitch. Goddamn karma. Some people never learn. Well, I tried, guys. I tried. Yeah. That's really. As long as I'm not. I wouldn't like to be in your shoes, though. Leave everything in here. I'd better keep. For the 
I you have when but you know but be but it under could you the, you this you may do not under method there must be something about that story after all maybe that's what you tell people some people never learn yeah, all right, so let's go to the new camp. So that all reload was for nothing. QQ. Karma, guys. You gotta hate karma. I doubt that's ever likely to change. Thought that had been cleared up ages ago. You shouldn't believe. So it's on the sixth day, only available during the day. That's really not my problem. Now the focus stones are gonna take a bit of time, a bit, um, but uh, I will make sure that it's all in this particular video. Even though I reloaded for nothing, you know, it's not gonna change anything. <laughs> Guarding a poker, wow, beautiful. Oh, right. I, I shouldn't forget one thing that uh, before I will make sure that the area got raided, um, and that does you know the free mine on the attack. Got to first talk with Bolero about his so called invincible weapon, which is a poker, five damage.
one more level and then I have the fourth circle. video in about uh, two parts, you know, uh, each episode, well, each part basically, you know, two focused on areas, I think that's uh, a bit better, it's already I've deleted with me Karma, because Karma is a b -b -b bitch. Also gonna check how me pal, what was his name again? Lefty. How how that pathetic bugger is doing. Kick his ass again. I know that he knows that he didn't give the peasants some water so I have to kick his ass because he has to do it How are you my friend? Oh man, what do you want? The peasants look thirsty. I'll see you to it. Don't worry. Okay, okay! How- oh. I've had a really bad day, and I'm looking for a way to relieve my tension. Just stay like that for a minute. You really like taking advantage of me, don't you? Okay, okay! Super Ninja Kick. He's had enough. You can have that. Ah, it's you. My friend Lester from the swamp camp told me all you did there. For somebody who hasn't been here for long, you've come quite a way. I came quite close to becoming worm food a few times, too. I have an important message for the magicians of water. Then you should talk to Satyrus. He's the highest of the water mages and spends all day studying some writings or other. But no matter how important your message is, the guards of the upper level won't let you through to him. Can't you put in a good word for me? I can't, but Kronos, the Keeper of the Ore, might be able to give you permission. Where can I find this Keeper of the Ore? If you proceed from here, you'll come across the big dwelling cave behind the dam. Kronos is usually at the grid over the big ore mound. But he's a bit arrogant. You'll have to convince him that your message is important. See you later. See you later. Alright, so let's see what uh, Cypher has to offer in the amount of ore. Stop! You know the rules. Scrapers and rogues only. Are you going to try and stop me? No, just go! Show me what you have. Here. Ah, I see you've been a good boy. And didn't use any of the ore. Good. 
Wouldn't like to be in his shoes, though. There was a time when things would have gone thought. very differently. Let's talk about something else instead. Three old paw friends, oh, just for you. Never learn. That's there you go. Really I'm generous. Don't listen to all. There must. That's really not my problem. If you think, I'd better keep out. Show of me your goods. Choose something. That's really not my that problem. wasn't very clever. You you junk. Everything you hear. I'm not listening to all the blathering anymore. You shouldn't believe everything you hear. As long as How's things? We put another spoke in Gomez's wheel. Three dead gods and lots of stuff to sell. I'll drink to that. You're one of the guys who keep raiding the old camp. No. Only when it's worth it. What have you got to offer? Let's rephrase that question. What have you got to offer? I'm only interested in big consignments. Balor said you'd be interested in swampweed. Mm-hmm. You want to trade? Same old story. Let's make a deal. What do you want? I better keep out of it. Your ore yeah, for one, what you tell your people. potions for two. Let's talk about something. And else for instead. three, you're not gonna Same get weed, but you time. will get Somebody weapons. Just, just, How about that map? Let's talk about something else instead. Okay, okay, just for you. Really oh, hey, no, 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 those are the wrong skins. Rely on somebody, and you're in trouble. That's how it goes. <laughs> there you go. A couple of wolf skins. Bonus. Rely on some. That won't have. Maybe. That's Rely on somebody, problem. and you're in trouble. That's how it goes. Some people never. Some people never learn. All right. So let's talk with this. Keeper of the ore. Same old story every time. As long as I'm not involved. For the honor of magic. For the honor of my home. I have an important message for Satyrus. What could be so important that our spiritual leaders should interrupt his important studies for it? Kor Kalam has left the Brotherhood with some fanatical Templars. He wants to find the sleeper on his own and wake him up at all costs. I've never trusted him, second guru or not. He's vain, insidious, and he's capable of anything. The Brotherhood is better off without him. I'll tell Satyrus about it as soon as I get the chance. Leave now, for the honor of magic. Yeah, yeah. The gurus have recognized that they're praying to an evil archdemon. All of a sudden, they now think their sleeper is a demon? Sounds like another mad idea of the Brotherhood, but should they be right, all of us in the colony here might be in grave danger. You must report to Satyrus at once. He must decide what is to be done. Where can I find Satyrus? Go to the upper level. Tell the guards there that you have my permission to pass. The password is Tetriandoch. Saturus is by the pentagram. He spends almost all day there, studying how to blow up the big ore mound. You don't say. For the honor of magic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to acquire magic writings. Keep it to yourself. People don't need to know it. There must be something about the Both. story. Both. That is also interesting. It was obvious it's less that there would be trouble ahead. Like to be in you have to watch what you tell me. Since my character is mainly gonna be built on both. Hmm. Instead of strength, I mean, nah. Same old story what else you time. got? You got ball lightning, ice bolt, ball lightning. There we go. And um, what else do you have? Nothing. Good eight. There was a time when things would have gone very differently. But keep it to yourself. People don't need to know. I better keep out of it. 
Don't I better keep out of it. Have gone very differently. As long as I'm not involved. People always talk. Same old story every time. With I can make a bit of a loss. I doubt that's ever likely to change. All right, so let's get to our a good friend, Saturus. But uh, I think uh, the focus nodes are going to be in the next Stop. episode. Stop! Nobody may pass without the password. It's taking longer than I anticipated. Again. The password is Tetriandach. That's right. You may pass. So I will get the mission, you know, complete, uh, deliver the uh, focus stone and the book. And uh, then I will quickly and get the quest, of course. And then I will get quickly to the old mine. Um, old mine, free mine, and uh, kick Bolero's ass. And uh, then in the next episode, my apologies about that, we have to do the uh, focus though, because uh, I think it's gotta take a bit too much. I could at least do one more. And I could do one, the one near... Uh, For the one, honor of magic! The one with Milton. I can do that one, that one is relatively close. I have important news from the Brotherhood's camp. If Kronos gave you permission to visit me, it must be important news indeed. Iberian is dead. He died during the ritual invocation of the sleeper. Iberian dead? That's bad news. Very bad news indeed. Who's leading the Brotherhood now? That power-hungry and deceitful core Kalam? No. Kalam has turned his back on the Brotherhood. He's taken some Templars with him. Nobody knows where they've gone. Why is that? He was in second place after Iberian. Certain events have convinced the Gurus that their way is the wrong one. Their god seems to be an evil archdemon. One of the gurus nearly killed me under the influence of the sleeper, although I had saved his life just briefly beforehand. Korkalam was the only guru who didn't want to admit the true nature of the hellish creature. That's why he's left the camp in the swamp. I see. Well, at least we're lucky in this regard. Korangar is a good man. He's tough, but honest. If anybody could prevent the Brotherhood from falling apart after this spiritual catastrophe, he can. I have this almanac. Iberian used it to charge the focus. Very good. We need the knowledge contained in this book to charge the five original focus stones. I'll take the almanac. I have this focus. You're holding the key that can unlock all our bonds. It's one of the five focus stones which were used to create the magic barrier. And with the help of the very same focusing power of these stones, will tear down the Great Wall of Energy. But won't that use up an awful lot of power? True. But in all these years, we've untiringly collected ore instead of trading it for luxuries with our jailers. As you must know, each ore nugget contains a certain amount of magic power. With the aid of the energy thus amassed in the ore mound, we'll be able to destroy the magic barrier. Sounds dangerous. The explosion will be merely of a magical nature. It will only destroy everything that's been modified by the magic inside the barrier. There is no danger to us human beings. Here, take the focus. I hope it really will be of some use to your plans with the ore mound. What are you going to do with the focus and the almanac now? Nothing. We need the four remaining focus stones first. Unfortunately, we don't have any of these four magic stones. I'm willing to find the four remaining focus stones for you. After all, I'm quite keen on getting out of here sometime myself. I must warn you, searching for them will prove as difficult as it will be dangerous. Since conflict with the old camp is getting worse every day, I cannot give you any mercenary either. You'll be totally on your own. Well, that's nothing unusual for me. I'll find a way to organize these things. Your confidence does you credit, but you'll need some items to assist you. Take this map here. It's old but on it you'll see the original locations of the focus stones when the barrier was created. Also, this spell scroll will enable you to travel back to our camp faster. 
Finally, you need to speak to Riordian. He brews the potions for the camp. You'll find him in his hut, here, on the upper level. May you return in one piece? Alright, so let's get the Folkstone with Milton, and uh, then we're gonna go to the second part. For the honor of magic. For the honor of Mahor. Greetings, magician. I am Riordian, the alchemist. I gather you want a potion? Satyrus sent me. Ah, come here. I've already been informed. Here, take these potions. They're potions of all kinds. Now go and bring us the focus stones. These artifacts are our only hope. You're just... 76 strength, GG. Alright, so let's quickly go to the uh, Bolero guy. Kick his ass for backstabbing me with the, uh, the supplies, all the supplies that he wants is for a weapon that can defeat any foe, which is true. It only will take a long time, you know, before you actually kill someone with that weapon. Well, it is possible. It's a uh, poker, which is about 5 damage. Not that great. Not a use whatsoever. But uh, you could kill any foe with it. That's not a lie. Teach this guy a lesson. Hey, you! You're not one of my men. What are you doing here? I need to go on. Then leave me alone! No, you leave me alone. Last time I tried to kick his ass, he went like, What are you done? Instant knockdown. Now the tables are turned. Hey man, you can't do that to me. What more do you want? Piss off. Get on somebody else's nerves or you'll get it. Got it? I'm afraid I'm going to have to whack you one. We've had our fun, now get lost, man. I believe you didn't understand me. Okay then, you asked for it, you were warned. He's had enough! He still did pretty nice amount of damage. Really? Karma is a bitch. You'll be very sorry for that.
least I showed him a lesson though, even though it cost me my life. Oh well. I'm, I'm thinking, did I die five times? I'm, I'm not quite sure. If I die, if I did indeed die five times, the uh, timestamps will tell you. Um, they will be eventually be posted, you know, and if uh, my calculation then was wrong, you know, with the timing of the deaths, etc., the uh, timestamps will adjust that. <coughs> but only if the timestamps are done, because uh, that's the moment we have to rewatch the videos, you know make the timestamps and then I actually see because of the other videos who already timestamped exactly how many times I died at the end of the game you know but uh, the current death counts are just an estimation basically if I'm gonna get myself one of the well the second of the five focus stones first one we got for Iberian, which was uh, with Nairaz, and um, get that done, and then we're gonna go to part two of this episode, where we will collect the remaining three. one level up and uh, then I'm ready for circle four now I cannot deliver all the focus stones before I delivered uh, well entered circle four it's a personal rule you know so you guys don't really have to do so but it's a personal r rule for me you know because since I joined the fire mage, it's right that they teach me the highest level. And as soon as I switch sides, you know, the other levels will be achieved. Circle 5 or Circle 6. <laughs> This is gonna be interesting with all these undead skeletons. Aww. Greetings! My friend Lester from the Swamp Camp told me about your great deeds there. I am impressed. You've become very strong. I do my best. Ah, uh, yes. Always modest, aren't you? What are you doing here? There is an ancient ring of stone not far from here. In its center lies the entrance to an underground vault. Some sort of tomb? Yes, something like that. There is something in that tomb that I'd like to have. I'm looking for a focus stone. It must be here somewhere. 
That almost sounds as if we were both looking for something in the same place. Why don't you go down to the tomb and get what you're looking for? Oh, that's a long story. I'd have to go a long way back to explain. Go ahead. I'm in no hurry. All right. After the creation of the magic barrier which imprisons us all, one of the magicians sealed a magic artifact down there. Is this artifact one of the five focus stones? Exactly. So you already know the story of the five focus stones. Don't tell me you're after the focus stone as well. No, I'm not interested in the focus stone. I'm looking for an orcish talisman. The artifact was sealed away? Yes. A powerful spell protects it. The first grave robber trying to swipe the focus will be cursed and doomed to an existence as a restless undead. We'll have to protect the tomb from other grave robbers. How can you get past that curse? There will be no need for that now. Some years ago, an ore baron out pleasure hunting for orcs was careless enough to enter the tomb. Now he is the guard of the treasures down there. What about that talisman? I believe its former owner used it to defend himself against angry orcs. If I'm right, the talisman may be of great use. We should seek out the tomb together. You get the talisman, and I'll have the focus stone. All right, but there is one little problem. A problem? Yes, the guard down there in the tomb. Can't he be cut into handy little pieces? That wouldn't be too easy. He seems to be extremely resistant against the effects of normal weapons. Let me guess, you already got a plan, right? Mm, well, I have a plan, but I can't carry it out on my own. Tell me. I have a spell scroll with a very powerful spell here. The spell will destroy all the undead who fall under it. Then it should be child's play to take out the tomb. Mm, well, not quite. The guard is not on his own any longer. Probably later grave robbers who were no more successful than he was. I went down there once and I was nearly killed. One man on his own cannot do much there. Give me the spell scroll and we'll do it together. Good, very good. I hoped you would say that. However, we only have one spell scroll. Use it for the guard. The other undead can be defeated in normal fights as well. I see. Well, which way leads to the Ring of Stone? Follow me. For the honor of magic. Here we are. The tunnel here leads directly to the tomb. Then let's go and visit the guard. Why are these guys? Good. You have the talisman. Here, take it. That was our deal. Thank you, my friend. I never forget anybody who helped me. I'll go back to the old camp. Perhaps we'll meet there. Perhaps we will, mate. Stop the the uh, recording 
and end episode uh, age part one for now and uh, continue with episode eight part two where we're going to continue to search for the remaining three focus stones so I want to thank you guys for watching and if you like what you see hit the subscribe button the subscribe button yeah button and uh, leave a thumbs up behind a thumbs down if you didn't like it positive or negative feedback anything is welcome but uh yeah just checking what milton is doing but uh see you guys next time